this weekend we had a bit of a breakthrough, Emma and I. Um, mm. um, Emma is my partner. And because we've been getting pregnant. And the inevitability of what was about to happen to us finally got through to us. Um, okay, it was Emma's birthday this weekend and all of her family, all of them have bought books about pregnancy, about, about having a baby. Uh, well, we finally got around to looking through them and finally agreed to go out and buy some stuff. Frightening. <laughs> really. Um, so we have a room. We have a room now. Um, I mean, formerly it was just used for stuff, but now it's it, it's got a it's got a chest of drawers. Yeah, it's curtained. Uh, there's a changing mat. It's all polythene wrapped. It's it's daunting, isn't it? <laughs> uh, um, we have a date. We have a date. Yep, the twenty uh, third of November. It is within thinking distance. It's I mean it's there. Yeah, um, the starts of the rest of our lives, I guess. You see, um, going to sleep with like a heavily pregnant lover was not something I was expecting to be doing at this time in my life. Uh, I mean, it's great, really. Um, I mean, your arm's not quite big enough to fit around two people and there's a lot of feelings of like inadequacy, obviously, in this. I mean, I'll, 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 I'll put my hand on Emma's stomach, right? And, and she'll say stuff like, can't you feel it? And I'll say, yeah. But I can't because the kick will happen somewhere else and then my, my hand's not big enough and then... We have eight pillows. We have eight pillows in the bed. I've got one, she's got seven. She 